That one was easy. Uh, uh, uh. Nothing's going to be scary. Ah. <laughs> if you wanted the real explanation, anyway. If you, if you like that explanation, make sure to click the back button. It stands up. I didn't even notice that. Oh, I saw it. What was it? Oh. Sometimes, photos are worse. Anything goes, you know, this year just gonna blow like I won't have it. You won't manage, so I'm real, I'm sad like magic. People, anything goes here, back again with another ghost reaction. If you're new to the channel, channel, channel. With that! Make sure you're liking, sharing, and subscribing you as did always. Not hit that note at all. Close. All right, cool. Make sure you're liking, sharing, and subscribing as always. Hitting us up on those comments. Definitely let us know other suggestions. You can even join to support the man even further, and click the bell for the notifications. Today we're back with King Frost Mirror. Mm, been a while since you watched one of his Mr. Chatty Patty himself yeah it has been a while and we got what the scariest video is too creepy to watch alone oh you're lucky then isn't it yeah because it's, it's always aimed at you oh wow it's 1949 the length or something that's the year you was born do you want me to punch you up yeah <laughs> what would that make me smart ass your shit 73 just throwing shit together no how old am I no it would make you 73 if you were born in 1949 how old am I 73 how old am I now seven <laughs> nearly 74 <laughs> anyway I don't know I don't check how old you are I'm still in my 20s too much Should we watch ghost videos? Old man. Sit out. <laughs> Stay close. Doesn't sound good. The next video My comes cemetery to us from user nice. John the Paranormal Guy. John states that he has been investigating the paranormal for the last eight years after a near-death experience. <sighs> John visits various haunted houses and locations trying to confirm or debunk the sightings that people have experienced. Today we will be looking into his visit to the old San Antonio Cemetery. The cemetery is quite old, established in 1853 That's and is old. apparently home to over 3,800 graves. John states that from the moment he entered the cemetery he felt a strange energy, as though someone was watching him, although he was definitely alone. Or was he? As John is filming the dark graveyard, he captures this chilling footage. A dark figure can be seen to the left of the flashlight. However, as yeah, the light hits the entity, no? it suddenly yeah, disappears. Could it possibly be the trapped soul of one of the people buried at the old San Antonio Cemetery? John states this is one of the most chilling captures, and I can only imagine what it was like to be there in person. Creepy. No, I ain't got time. You can see it clearer now, you know where it is when this when this in it. That one was easy. Uh uh uh. Nothing's gonna be scary. <laughs> There's nothing easy about. It was the last time it did it. Once you knew it was, it was there, so obvious. You could tell, yeah, that how. Uh, but I think that was brightened up a bit. Yeah, the, the last. Yeah, the last shot. Once you could actually see it, you could actually like make make the whole figure out. And it, still see it disappear though. Yeah, and once the light hit it, just my, my brain. My I, I don't think my brain is set up to acknowledge stuff like that. It just immediately ignores. Puts it in a, I don't think you would ever notice it with your own eyes. Or the naked like eye. Yeah. Or oh, because of how quick it is. Or because of how scared and like even sometimes. You have you ever just like been sitting and stuff and it just like shadows hit your the corner of your eye? I'm checking that shit out. Hmm? I check it no, out. No, but that's what I'm saying. Like it's only you don't really ever notice it like in the corner of your eye and like when you actually try and pay attention to whatever. 
light or shadow hit the corner of your eye, it's not there. There obviously. used to be us recording in the bathroom, bro. That was me. Every. You used to do what in the bathroom? When we was recording and the doors open. Oh, you did in the yeah. crack of the door. Yeah. You used to see stuff. Yeah. I'm not surprised. Why are you not surprised? It must have been the same people that was throwing the my AirPods off the table and stuff that time. Can't believe it's happened. Now let's take a look at some footage from a paranormal investigator by Paranormal Me. Ali is a well-known ghost hunter who resides in Turkey and often visits I'm the most guessing haunted and famous locations of the country. There's going to be a lightning strike and this particular investigation, the shadow's going to appear because it was called lightning shadow. He's visiting an abandoned home high up in the mountains. On this particular night, the weather is truly terrible. The rain is pounding down and it seems as though a storm is approaching. You said that. This be an omen for and the night my dumb, come. scared brain already is <laughs> making that bag think it's there's a person, someone there. Yeah. Yeah. Once Ali enters the home, it really doesn't take long for some strange occurrences to begin. <laughs> Your dumb brain. Yeah. Don't you find it weird that you can't capture rain on camera? You can't. It's very hard. It's not really camera, though. you can't really... Another dryer. That's not rain. Strange knocking can be heard from inside one of the rooms. What did he focus on? <laughs> the statue. When Ali goes yeah. to investigate, it appears that some unknown force is moving the doors. Why is he? I feel a lot more comfortable when I hear them saying prayers like the one in Jordan when they wasn't I was shocked seriously oh well, when they wasn't praying he was not saying a damn thing did you see that? I think it was the camera um, where the cameras were seems to have gotten even worse during this time and now a thunderstorm is raging through the area what Ali catches next is extremely shocking ah. in the light of the lightning strike a dark figure can be seen by the side of the building the entity still does dark. appear to have a human form, however, it is entirely dark. It's when Ali approaches the side of the building, no person can be found. That was in his eyesight as well. I don't know how he's not According picked that up. weather expert, apparitions or spirits that, that is source of energy. Like he got nervous from the, the third statue or whatever. To communicate with the living. There's no so way he saw that with his naked that's eyes. That's so dark as well. Mm -hmm. enough energy for the spirit to appear in front of Ali. Who knows? Yeah, that was that was one of the darker shadows that I think we've seen. That that was that was like that was pitch. That was dark black. That was pitch. Yeah. Like darker than the other shadows and stuff. It was just that was pitch. And on top of that, you had you had the opposite of pitch black in the sky lighting up everything. Oh no. And if it was a shadow, that light would kind of like break through the shadow a bit. Well it was like A bit. You, from you know how shadows work, right? Yeah, but that's no but what I'm saying is even if it was like like it was so dark that the light wasn't even breaking through. You know, like when you see shadow figures, sometimes the the edge of it, yeah, yeah, yeah. the it's kind of like blurry or fuzzy because the light's breaking through it. No, but that no. one was just like the lightning, just yeah, because obviously. Shape. But the, I think the whole the whole thunder and the lightning isn't isn't the same kind of energy in the first place. So say you got UV lights, they like that. 
that energy more. Of course they do. It's Electro Chronicle. They like it more. What is it? Electro Chronicle energy. Oh. Because it, when it hits their mainframe, the Electro Chronicle energy heightens up their equilibriums. And then the ghost. You're doing this again! The ghost. <laughs> the ghost anti establishmentarianism. Um, no, it comes together. Disestablishmentarianism, if you're to say it right. comes together in one mm. conjugal ball of substantial. Gathered. Electronicalness. Okay. And. Bang. Then. then that's, yeah. that's why they're always. Um, <laughs> Well, uh, if you wanted the real explanation, anyway. If you, if you like that explanation, make sure to click the like button for the electroconicalness. <laughs> <laughs> the next clip comes to us from the user Fluvis. The footage was taken in 2015. It was pulled from a security camera in an office building. Unfortunately, not much information regarding the context of the sighting is available. However, we do know that this was filmed at 2 a.m. and that nobody was in the building at the time of the recording. Let's take a look. Someone's gonna come through skanking. Oh, is that growing? It's coming. In the video we can see what looks to be a storage room with some miscellaneous office furniture and a small garage door. Nothing seems amiss at the beginning, but quickly we notice something strange appears near the center of the room. A weird black figure. I'm trying to work to out on the floor because it looks while. like the garage door is bounce, open a bit, it and it looks like it. As innocent as a small animal. What is it? It falls in. Yeah, but then it stands up. I didn't even notice that. twisting and contorting itself into strange shapes. It seems to grow and shrink at will. Viewers have warned that this very odd shadow creature could possibly be demonic, especially given the inhuman like form. It like falls in as like a puddle shape and then stands on its. Actually, you can even see the movement of its like film. shoulders or whatever it is as it Limbs. falls in. Yeah, and then it just stands up and. It reminds me of like usually always referring back to a computer game, but you know, like when the Mortal Kombat ninjas kind of just appear, so like usually just through it's fluid along the floor like a shadow, and then they come up through whatever portal they decided to use. You know what I was thinking when they said that's from 2015? Mm. Imagine how much CCTV there is that's captured stuff. That people haven't reviewed and found. Okay, yeah, yeah. Like, how how much, how many businesses or public buildings or whatever, they reset just it. never yeah they check reset their, they reset their footage it. from the night before. They um like obviously you've got the normal ones and then you've got like a lot, a lot of them are, have like motion detection in it. So yeah, so that's what I was gonna say. They, so like it will, it will um like notify where movement yeah, was watch. so that's yeah, why so people they... review it so a lot of people just don't even check it they just yeah but then that's still down to the person like the security yeah. company that's in charge of reviewing it and if they review it and see nothing within 10-15 seconds or like no lights or no movement it's like oh fuck this so there's there's this sort of recycle bin of security footage that just has a bag of shadow dance. even the room was weird yeah it's like why was the garbage door and then file cabinet and it, was it like, looked like the garage door was open a bit as well. Yeah, it did. So it looked like something crawling in. And you think, oh, it's just an animal, but then it... It morphed. And then just... <laughs> then just floated off. It kind of just minimalised and then started skanking on the cabinet, but you know. Now let's take a look at a clip taken by user Aria Zariel. This clip comes Hello. out of Malaysia. And at mm. first glance, you wouldn't even notice anything creepy about it at all. In the video, there is a group I don't like the fact that it's in slow mode because now it's just going to be a weird ghost face be behind someone. Friends or maybe a family. 
Everyone in the video seems to be having a good time and nobody notices anything amiss. It is only after checking the footage later that the cameraman saw something odd. Let's watch. Or is it in slow mo just both? Oh, I saw it. What was it? The shadow. Oh, there's a face in the window looking in. Look at the window above the <sighs> I want that. I hold that. A figure can be seen looking in from the window. And it's blurry as well, isn't it? The entity definitely looks like a human man. Can However, we get a zoom if you look closely, it appears that there are no go. distinguishable features of the say. spirit whatsoever. The concept of faceless ghosts is actually well established. In Japan, they are known as noperabu and apparently will often take on the form of I wish I never knew that. To those Same. That, are yeah, that, However, that information I don't are also mostly known to be harmless other than occasionally frightening people <laughs> perhaps this is why the group did not notice the uninvited guest in their window the group stated though that they have never seen this person. that guy let me know what you guys think of this capture he's looking that way as well mm -hmm. oh the other not guy the in the room man, yeah the other guy in the room yeah. yeah he's basically seeing it and saying i wish i never knew that no parabu was a thing yeah and it's funny how that Ghost in Japanese is boo. Sorry? Because no para boo means something, something ghost. No, no, no face, face ghost. Faceless ghost. Yeah. So ghost must mean boo must mean ghost in Japanese. I'm not going to always I always wondered where boo. the whole like boo noise came from. Like why, why do when you see a ghost you say oh boo? That word, but that's obviously where it comes from. So the more you know every every day is a school day I'm not even gonna I'm gonna leave you to it but now we know another foreign phrase as well so sorry what was it called no what was the thing called the faceless ghost no paraboo no paraboo I think I wanna hear it again just so I know I'm saying it right a figure can be seen looking in from the window it's a proper face as well. the entity definitely looks like a human man however if you look closely it appears that there are no distinguishable features of the spirit whatsoever the concept of faceless ghosts is actually well established in japan they are known as no parabu and apparently okay no i was saying it with not enough accent on it but no parabu mm. There's one more to add to the list with Sound Nima and No Mamashwe and Fafankulo, but I knew that anyway before. Shut up, Macac. Your mum, how about that one? How about that phase? The next video comes to us Sorry if you're watching this. Investigate the Phantom Watcher. Phil is from Brisbane, Australia and is an avid ghost hunter. He often will live stream his paranormal investigations for his viewers to be able to interact with him and experience the hauntings in real time. The clip we will be taking a look at today comes from one of his live streams. In this particular one, Phil is visiting an abandoned farmhouse that is said to be haunted. In the stream, he's exploring entirely alone. He spends some time inside the home and it doesn't take long until he starts experiencing some paranormal occurrences. Knocking noises and even a few voice-like sounds can be heard around the house. Do you mind if I smoke in the house? <laughs> can you repeat that? Is that a zubs or roll up? Because if it's a zoops, should not be smoking that and doing this. Why? Huh? Why not? You can't, you can't move like that. You can't move like that. Doing your well, that's what I'm doing in my head, but really I'm going... Oh, 
thought that was his shadow. Why would he have a... Until it ran. Because the, la the light from the phone silence, or whatever is on. Suddenly, a dark shadow appears to move directly behind Phil. His shadow is on the, the ceiling. Yep. This could not possibly be Phil's own shadow based on the way he is moving or the lighting in the room. Is this one of the spirits said to haunt the famous farmhouse? That is close Many as well. viewers are saying this is most likely a shadow figure due to the human-like form and tall stature. But let me know your thoughts. I don't like Frostman anymore. I, I honestly don't know what's worse. <laughs> like seeing it down the hall with my own eyes or, or only noticing later how close, close it, it was. was, yeah. What about if your senses kicked in and like all all your hairs were standing up at the back of your neck and all of that? And you remember that. When you watch the video or whatever, you remember that feeling moment, like that. Yeah. I mean I think seeing it down the hallway is I'm not, ten times worse. If I'm doing something like that, that's my body's doing that the whole time anyway. <laughs> So it's not even like I'd be able to pick out a moment where I felt weird because as soon as I walk in, my body is trying to shut down. Weird mode activated. Yeah, yeah. <sighs> yeah, I don't know. That was that was. He's lucky. It's like the moment he stopped looking at what he was recording, and he like looked at something else. Because he was looking at himself. Yeah. And then the moment he's eyes went here, yeah, that's yeah, when yeah. it moved. That's when it past. So tricky. I mean... They boo. know what they know what they're doing. Boo? Mm, these no powder balls know what they're doing. The following video stems from user Breakmark and was shared by the channel Mr5x. It is a truly mystifying capture. It was taken from security footage back from the beginning of 2021. The security camera is facing outside at the side of the building as well as the street. No, because the it kept going. The cameras noticed something strange one night. Well, that please stop me then. The siding online to see what others think. I know what that is. It's Pac-Man. It's quick. It's quicker than the first one. It's it's Pac-Man. Um, 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 um. <laughs> I can't even make out what the shape is and then just disappears okay no it's still going it's just behind the numbers that it's still it's get it's moving further away now rather than in a straight line what is that maybe it's uh, the building on the left of the frame something appears to lantern? be walking very quickly towards one the of the ones people like with the exactly lantern on top that float but like maybe it's losing this it seems to radiate light flame. and you can see what appears to be either a head or maybe an because the camera quality is not way, i was going to say it looks like a head capture. the entity continues to fly the camera quality isn't that the building and into the sky the strangest part of this clip yeah, comes that, from when it goes the past that sign is, is when it's got right the most the shape it to change and it was like a head changing shape if you wing it but that, no but that's when I'd say it looks most like a lantern oh. when it goes past that sign but then here it starts to just to do whatever yeah it's just on jazz some viewers have said that this looks like a witch moving through the night sky while others believe this to be a spirit caught on camera what do you make of but this you just don't know because of how pixelated the, the video is what was filmed this night no more now and that's the video it ended <laughs> video done is that because of the the next title of what next title the video is finished <laughs> I don't know what title you're talking about what did you think that was honestly if I had to make a realistic guess, I'd say like a lantern that's starting to lose its heat. You know what lanterns I'm talking about, innit? That people like for like... Um, people. Past people. Yeah, but what are they... Um, there's a word. Jacko. No, there's a word that people get together for like a remembrance of someone, but I skip my head. Oh, so remembrance. Um, but yeah, like that sort of thing. And it, like, it looks like it's 
losing its flame or whatever, but you just don't know because the camera quality is so bad. Yeah, that looked like a. It looked like a character from a game. And I was gonna guess a drone first of all, but it's just like the way it moves. It looks like it's. But when it when it gets further away from the camera, it looks oh. even weirder. So it just starts to change shape. Your favorite. Let's take a look at a oh, boo. taken in a haunted bar. That's a beer is bad. To us from Believe a Paranormal Experience, who are a team of ghost hunters based out of Illinois. This time the team is visiting a bar near Chicago that's been in existence since 1889. Parts of the bar were also used as a general 100. store, milk depot no, and a gas the station. Number. The bar even functioned as a speakeasy oh. during the prohibition. However, many yeah. believe that in this the bars of 18, 18, years of existence, mm. they may have Found acquired some ghosts as Just well. After you there think. are also rumors that some of the previous owners of the building may be lingering around as Nearly as old as you. On this particular day, however, the team is looking at a potential ghost sighting located near the woman's washroom. Of course it is. Oh. Sometimes. Photos <laughs> of... Worst than video. Sort of shadow figure. So he I think probably the worst than videos anyway. Shot. The photo appears to show a young girl in what looks to be a Victorian style dress, looking towards the camera. Of course, there were no children present. When you clear up the, the, the picture, it looks even worse. Mm -hmm. But it doesn't the look like she's the got bartender on duty. Straight away, identified the girl in the photo as one of the spirits that haunts the bar. Or perhaps she's one of the children of past regular the top patrons. Of her what do you think? Frostmare's gone past 10, 12. He's yeah, just... he, does, he never has a certain number. He just puts what he's got. Boo. No parabu. Or just boo. Not the kittens. Mm. They know there's ghost videos mm. playing as well. They start off young. I mean, that ghost girl wasn't too bad. It's just, with pictures, because it's that moment, sometimes it captures a lot... It worse, captures the moment. A lot scarier details, because in, like, in videos, they always pixelate, and it's hard to like pick up yeah, clear it, detail. It, it struggles to when, gain focus. When they like, cleared the photo up, you could actually see... like Facial features, yeah, yeah. which is something that doesn't yeah. hardly exist. Facial features hardly exist. On the cameras, no parabu. Mm. And then you got no parabu, and you got shadow things, and then you got that. That just looks like a little girl with no arm. The next clip comes to us thanks to Bizarre okay, well, and Stephanie. We've seen this one before. Mystery. So is this the last? The video was apparently no, I think it's the last in 2010. one. 2010. However, the channel because it's a very it's a very quick one for how long's left in the um, video. The footage we're taking a look at now is quite well, old, seen this approximately on the 40 years old. Actually. It's weird. The uploader found this Hello, footage of his dad as a child, filmed by his Probably. grandfather. Or maybe it's the last one. You picked the wrong car park with four times. Went to walk no, it's not the last one. Day nature. This area is apparently quite private. It's not even like they're the same well cup. The you can see which one the drinks in because one of the cups is see through and the other one's red, so you can see which one has drink in it. Well, you picked the wrong one up <laughs> four times. That's scary. I Hello. Yeah. It's just just old videos are always creepier than. The... What was they doing? It appears that there's a woman they're just on like a family day family. out. No, what's, what what were they doing? The uploader's father. Being a ghost. That mm. This is a ghost capture. To the odd stillness because they're not even like in the same the era of clothes no as those the they look like they're in like the wild west clothing like you know what i mean where it's like a yeah where it's like a like a blouse and like a long skirt sort of thing yeah well that one we've definitely seen and i think we've seen that a couple of times yeah um i think my it's view, the old, like, my view is still the same. It's just how how complicated it is to be in this generation and understand how editing and stuff like that works, but also understand 
it only works from a certain point. That video is way past and its sell by But there. that's I don't I don't think it's quite as old as like eight millimeter. If you know that that's an actual film, yeah, isn't yeah. It? I think that might be like a very early video camera. But I don't ever remember even like the oldest of video cameras that I've used having quite so like that bad quality that so potato. maybe it is even older than that and that's why it, it makes it worse because it's kind of like how jumpy as well just random stranger in the back video was uploaded no. by the fourth wall who upload paranormal content from Japan and who I like to feature Fourth wall states that no this was sent to them by user who would like to remain anonymous. Sometimes there's a ghost According on the them, way home. They had seen a ghostly figure in the same spot multiple times on their way home from work at night. Is that it? Is that the so legs? Besides that, they will film the spot and see what they catch. What is that? I think it's just a white shape I don't think it's legs or anything yeah, the moment it moves is a problem the individual who captured the footage said that in person the it ghostly is figure was much more clear in real life with even some distinguishing features of a person However, once the camera was on the ghost, it seemed only a faint white shadow could be seen. It is as though only the spirit's energy was captured on film. Do you think the white shadow, rather than black, might be an indicator that this is a friendly spirit? Notice the way the shadow seems to move and sway slightly. Weird. Oh, shout out to the man in full photo. Oh, there wasn't. He just literally yeah. no outro, no the end. Just, just killed the video off. Why is it replaying? That for for Japan, that was calm. Yeah, but it's still very weird. They they really have like, especially if the person that put it up said that it was a lot more detail with in, their in, own yeah, eyes, and then in the video yeah. it was just a white mist. Um, still wasn't nice. Seeing a. a so yeah. I think to some degree I'll be okay like the same way you know I kind of react to most of these is with nothing if I saw something like that I'll be fine until I get to the point where my brain says oh it's kind of really transparent and then once you see a gap between like the lamppost or whatever it was and the, the thing is where my brain goes panic now there's a gap what is it now tell me now and my brain is having a heart attack. Do you try and touch it? No, I'm trying to get close though. I want to see how close you get and if it gets more see-through or less. Yeah, same. <laughs> if you'd like to. If I'd like to what? Hydro. Oh, are you going to let me do it? Why did you done this first one? I'll do the last one. If you like this video, like the video. I don't know what you just said. <laughs> Make sure you subscribe to the channel as always. Get it down in the comments or any suggestions you have. I did it again. <laughs> no, you're staying in. Do it again. I do the first one. You do the last one. Remember? Do, do That's it. what you just said. Do, do, do it again. Click the bell if you want to get notified of when our videos drop. Click the join button if you want to support us even more. And whatever he said. No, I got a flow. When I react, the man's got cold. When I react, the man's got gold. You little biatch to get in your reacts. It was a big reacts, the man's got no. Anything goes, you know this year just gonna blow like I won't have it, you won't manage. So I'm real, I'm sign like magic. Part with a man that also savage. 